Parish Art Council. And today we'll be showing you around Soho Parish to tell you and show you about, around, about the arts. We are really proud to be awarded the Arts Mark Platinum Award and we're a really creative school. We're a Church of England school and Jesus said I have come in order that you might have life, life in all its fullness. Our school vision is that every child deserves to live, the li live life to the full. Our curriculum promotes emotional, intellectual, physical, spiritual and artistic development. As an arts council, we're here to help develop and, rem and promote the arts at school to give children lots of different opportunities. The arts help us to be confident and express our feelings. As part of the curriculum, we have music lessons every week, as well as art or design. We also dance for one and a half term every year as part of PE. We are always developing our creative writing skills and literacy throughout the week and use drama in different subjects to help explore and develop ideas. Before the pandemic, we had a written session which, was, which were a great opportunity to work with different teachers and different children around the school. These groups have been really different over the years. We've done sewing, radio producers, magazine editing, textiles, dance, sculpture, acting, spoken word, to name a few. We also have great after school clubs like choir, dance and art club. What's really unique to our school though is our Key Stage 2 rock bands which we play every year at our Soho Parish Food Feast. We learn all these things in different parts of the school. Come with us and I'll show you around. Although we're a small school, it's good to spread out sometimes, like when we rolled big tyres and paint. We often visit galleries, museums and theatres to be inspired and learn new things. We have used wax and textiles to make batik, clay to make sculptures, printing materials to do mono printing. This is our computer room. Sometimes we use iPads and laptops to make art, sounds and type up amazing stories. Nature is a good source of materials for art making too. Here we use sticks as a base for weaving. We also use instruments and our voices to make music and our bodies to dance, act and make artwork. We get taught mainly by our class teachers, but sometimes we have special people to come in and share their stories. We often take part in exciting projects where musicians, artists, architects and actors come in to work with us. Our year three class also takes part in Shakespeare programs. Every year where they work with professional actors and Schools. We have lots of creative parents at our school who like to get involved, whether that's running an enrichment group, volunteering during special weeks, or coming in on school trips. We don't just learn from adults though, we learn from other children in year groups, older than you or younger than you. It's really fun to help others to learn and to teach them something we know about. 
stated they were taking part in a Christmas like competition this year. An architect led workshops with the whole school and introduced us to the history of Christmas lights. We all got to enter the competition and 21 winners will be selected to have their designs turned into Christmas lighting displayed on lampposts in the street around our school this Christmas. It will be so amazing to see our artwork lit up like that. Something else that is quite unique about our school is that we have mindfulness lessons to support our well-being. Sometimes we use art here to help explore and express how we're feeling and draw what we notice. One of the main projects for us as art counsellors every year is to help plan our art week. In the past, Arts Council has worked on a partnership project with the London Transport Museum. They used the collection as starting point for a journey's theme tour. They led a staff meeting and an assembly to share their ideas. Our week is always so fun when we get to do it for the whole week. We get to, we get to be in different classrooms around the school and be with different teachers and different children.